guys, it's a Wednesday and today's vlog I'm gonna start with showing you what I'm working with. Let me pause the vlog I am watching. Um, I'm currently working on the Prepression Weeks monthly. We sold about 50 bundles, not counting the a la carte ones. So I'm gonna get those out as quick as possible because next weekend it will be my um, the Hobonichi Lover Sale which I am an admin for the group as well and it's our like inaugural group sale and I don't think we're when we're gonna have a next one or the next one but I am so excited for it <clears throat> um I'm still thinking of heading to work today so I'm gonna try and see what I can finish in the next half hour and then maybe I'll go to work but um working on the monthlies they're all scattered through um i'm also working on the samplers that i need to ship out today for the shop swaps that i'm doing with and carmine's here hello buddy he's just a little lonely he wants a little attention <laughs> so i realized that when i was vlogging before my camera was at 60 frames per second and my memory was getting um eaten up quickly and I was wondering why so I turned it down to 30 frames per second it's only a vlog and I really don't need 30 frames per second but there's a little bit of difference with the the blurriness so anyways hey guys so it's much later in the day guess who managed to go to work me I'm here for just a couple hours I'm gonna cook two different dishes and one side um, I think it's just gonna be rice but at home, I managed to cut pretty good amount of stickers, including samplers that I was talking about for um, shop swap. I, I have a hard time saying that. So I'm going to make a chicken dish and a beef dish. One is kind of French and then the other one's Mongolian beef. So. so I got two pans going. This will be the red onion and wilted spinach. This I need to get a little bit hotter because that's where the chicken's gonna get browned. I brown up my chicken with the skin side down first so that when I flip it over it's still like nice and brown and crisp and then over here we got the red onion starting to sizzle so I need it to soften a little more and then I can add the spinach to wilt. So I added the spinach and quickly turned the heat high and then low and then finally turned it off. Wilting is when you want it to just literally look like it's wilted more so like if it's still looking like this then it needs a little more time in there but you don't want your spinach to sit in the pan ooh, fogging up too long or else you're gonna be left with like nothing because <laughs> they tend to like shrivel or wilt you know the one really really good thing here at work is that all of these light that you see right now like on my face is just natural lighting and it's like natural filter <laughs> I can't get this at home. Okay, so now for the chicken, you're gonna add like um, at least, oh, that's my phone, a cup of orange juice and three very generous tablespoons of balsamic vinegar. So for the Mongolian beef, just pick a very kind of tender meat. Skirt steak's fine, but it could be tough. Alright guys, this is what the Mongolian beef looks like. I just need to simmer it down a little bit more and then just waiting on this. I flipped it over so that the other side can get a little bit moist. So yeah. So I guess that's it for now and then I will see you guys when I get home. Copyright. Hello guys. So welcome to Morocco. This is what it looks like. I can't 
can't vlog too much here because there's music playing in the background and I don't want to get copyrighted. But there's Louis. Honey, where are you? So dark. Oh, he's in the corner. Right there. All right, so I'll just get clips here and there. I didn't realize. Okay, so the music's playing. I gotta go, but I'll show you guys what's happening later. <laughs> it's rigged. <laughs> Alright, the last winner is... <laughs> Wait, I'm digging. <laughs> we trying again? <laughs> are you okay? Sticky. Alright, the last four digits are 2409. <laughs> Them are ring. <laughs> Congratulations. Hey. Alright guys, it's been two days since my last vlog. That was the pizza party that you guys have seen. I have just been um, foiling away here. I'm just trying to um look at these. These are like a bunch of Hobonichi kits. They are like really, really my best sellers in the shop, especially the foiled ones. Um, they will be coming back though for the Hobonichi Lover Sale, which is this coming weekend that I really, really need to prep for because I have no new stuff <laughs> and I've been holding back because I've been an admin of the Hobonichi Lovers Group for what three months four months now and we've been planning this for a while way before the announcement happened so i was holding off a lot of new releases because i wanted to release them during the sale there you go that's how i wanted to say it. so since i got home earlier today i already managed to make dinner which is arroz caldo which basically it's like arroz con pollo and it's just like Filipino kanji with chicken and all that but I don't have to worry about dinner anymore it's been made since like 5 30 and it's just seven o'clock so I have this mini stack of uh, stickers to cut these are not a lot so we'll see how quick I go through them but it's about half an inch or an inch thick so that's what I've been doing I also want to say thank you guys so much for the big support you've been showing my shop recently um, I have been like struggling with trying to figure out what you guys want to see in the shop and also balancing out what I want to release and I'm finding a good balance with that and I'm so happy because anything that I release right now you guys really really like and support it and just thank you for that because it's really hard to stay as relevant as possible in the last four years that I've been in the community so right now I am just gonna keep cutting these pile of stickers I want them done within the hour so we'll see how far I go and I'm currently re-watching um, Vampire Diaries because I need something that I've already seen that I don't really need to pay attention or else I'm gonna like pay attention and not concentrate on what I'm doing so I'm gonna do that now cut stickers and hopefully be done within the hour hey guys so it is now 8 30 it's exactly an hour since I last talked to you and I realized I've been uploading just compression after compression videos so I want to switch it up and just do some Hobonichi stuff and I realized that I still haven't up 
uploaded any Hobonichi videos since I came back on um, the YouTube grind of uploading stuff. So I'm going to do a cousin video right now with my leftover um, Simply Gilded stickers. I think I have to find the SD card that I used to film that but I really really want to use this in the cousin because on the cousin layout I just do it super super simple so I want to just try and see if I can film in the next half hour at least two videos so that I have a kind of like a library of um, videos for you guys okay now we're back I put the exposure down because it was a little high so that I could film and show you guys um, the planner better because it just gets a little too dark so I realized that I was talking about using the simply gilded one stickers but I didn't do it and I use my um, what is this called my sapphire island kit instead because I really really like to use this kit and summer is technically almost over so it wouldn't be appropriate to use it in the fall anyways um, I'm gonna film one more video and that will be for the Hobonichi weeks and then I will be done for my filming for the night and it's already 9 10 it takes me about 10 15 minutes to film one so we'll see how that goes all right just before I go I want to show you what I did so I filmed this plan with me and also this guy right here they're both the same kind of background going on and I've been meaning to use um, my own kit for both because last week I used um, Ashley's. Where's that Ashley's kit? Hey guys, so it's 9.30. I lost my voice. I filmed for the last 20 minutes and did like a pre, pre pen before the pen kind of plan with me. So um, in the middle of filming, I don't know if the camera picked it up or not, but my stomach was rumbly and I had already eaten dinner, but that was at like six o'clock. So I think it was a little too early. So I'm gonna eat a little bit of our scaldo. Um, <clears throat> all right, I'm gonna end the vlog here for tonight and 